think this is a really cool toy. This is, it's fine but hard. Many of us are looking for ways to pry children away from screens. The idea behind some of the smartest toys of 2014 is that technology can be about making things, not just consuming. I brought three new kinds of building kits to this playroom, which came equipped with two junior testers. My name is Kian, and I'm nine years old. I'm Kaya, and I'm 11, turning 12 in three days. These toys aren't so much intended to turn girls and boys into engineers, but to show them that they can use technology to express themselves. I'm going to call it a training computer. Kano is a $150 build-your-own computer set aimed at 6 to 14 year olds. Piecing it together is a snap. It teaches you how to program by letting you make tweaks to the code of fun games. But as soon as we got stuck in one program, the kids' interest started to fade. Okay, this is boring. <laughs> I would recommend it for more people who really want to code and that's all they want to do. To keep the little Zuckerbergs interested, Kano doles out points you can use to unlock virtual rewards. For the right child, Kano is a far better $150 present than a cheap tablet that mostly just plays games and movies. Modular Robotics, Moss, and Cubelets have color-coded pieces that can make robots that move and respond to their surroundings. No coding required! It's like a magnet building kit for robots, and if you connect them the right way, it can do stuff. But the trick is, you have to build them just right. And that got pretty frustrating for my testers. Mmm, tired of this. This is so complicated. Moss people, your instructions are a teeny bit confusing. They were a little hard to follow. Kian preferred the junior version, cubelets, which are larger and easier to build. They are little bricks of, I mean, big bricks of code. I'm impressed by how quickly he began making robots of his own invention. But cost is an issue. 20 cubelets will run you $500. Last up are Little Bits Circuits, which you can buy in kits that start at $100. The magnetized, color-coded circuit pieces are easy enough for children as young as 8 to use. And what you can create is awesome. You can make things that will feed your dog or turn on the lights just by clicking a button with, on your iPhone or something. And with the deluxe kit, you can make a bunch of pranks to pull on your friends. It was fun to make a few of the machines that come in the instruction manual, but we ran into trouble when it was time to come up with our own inventions. You'd have to think for a while and be pretty creative and familiar with the pieces. Of course, that's the whole idea behind Little Bits. But as a toy, it struggles to communicate its open-ended possibilities to some children. What I like about these toys is that they show young minds obsessed with apps that what's inside the machine can be as interesting as what's on the screen. Still, they often work best as a family activity with some pretty serious adult involvement.